We're in parking orbit. Scan complete. All right, where to next? Maybe we can explore some areas that have not yet been explored without going to the places for the main missions yet. So let's go probe around. Like we're coming up on a blue giant. From Aya, it's often the brightest star. First to rise. Launched. Tracking a huge mineral deposit.
Ambassador. I trust our people had a smooth transition to Aya. The Angara have been gracious. Everything's going well. Good. Keep me updated. Tan out. I've never lied to a director before. Pathfinder, it's a pleasure. I'm Ambassador Riala, Chief Diplomat for the Initiative on Aya. I was removed from Cryo specifically for this. The Waco. I know what it's like, jumping out of the cryopod and into the fire. You've had it far worse. My condolences on loss. I hear you're to thank for our new ties with Aya. This is our best shot at an alliance. Now we just need to keep our people from wrecking it, no matter how hard they try. If something's wrong, I need to know. Maybe you can help me fix it. A Salarian botanist named Sorvis Len is here, learning how to improve our crops. He sent an urgent comm, saying a member of the Angaran Resistance had threatened him. What happened? I'm not sure. Sorvis is an excellent scientist, but not the best communicator. I'm concerned this could escalate if someone doesn't look into it, but I don't have the staff to spare. I can go settle things. I'm a friendly face for both sides. That would be helpful. With any luck, we can prevent this from getting worse. What's our end goal for Aya? A strong alliance is all we can ask for. It's what we're working toward. Helios is the Angara's home. They dictate the terms of this partnership, not us. We need them as allies, and they could benefit from us. But we have to tread lightly. Show them we're not invaders. Historically, when two civilizations meet, one consumes or destroys the other. We need to break that cycle. Aside from Sorvis Len, is everything okay? Need anything else? Actually, yes. Director Tan gave me a project. He wants more Aya natives to live on the Nexus. He thinks it will deepen our partnership. A few Angara expressed interest, but... None of them will agree to live on the Nexus without speaking to you first. Why me? After what you've accomplished? I didn't want to bother you, but... You asked. I'll point you towards the candidates. If you could convince them to transfer, I'd be grateful. How many of our people have they let into the city? A strictly limited number, and only certain professions. Scientists, engineers, and scholars. The Angara have agreed to allow some of our people to work in Aya's research facilities. That's huge. It's more than I expected. Tan wants me to push for social visits, but I'm holding my ground. We need to move at their pace. They've been extraordinarily gracious, all things considered. I'll take whatever they're willing to give. That's all for now. I'm here if you need anything. The ambassador's messages are overflowing again. You're one of Ambassador Riala's candidates to live on the Nexus. I am. Glad you finally showed up. Let's get down to it. I've lived my whole life wanting to meet aliens who didn't want me dead. But my family's here. How can I stay in touch with them from the Nexus? You can send messages, talk to them on the comm. We'll even arrange a visit. 
You get it. All right. I'm in. Pathfinder, Ambassador Riala didn't think you'd have time for me. She said you needed to talk before agreeing to live on the Nexus. This is the opportunity of a lifetime. I'm an anthropologist, but I've only ever studied my own people. I've heard the Nexus is home to multiple species of cultures. It will be fascinating and possibly dangerous. Bacteria, viruses, other contaminants. My family worries about me. Are you sure I'll be safe? They wouldn't let me on Aya if I was a walking petri dish, would they? You aren't taking this seriously enough to satisfy my family. I can't go without their blessing. I'm sorry. Pathfinder. I'll leave you to it. Hello, Pathfinder. Any good news for me? Is this Angaran? I found it on one of your homeworlds. Sun above. It's an ancient Ravan, a musical instrument. It uses Angara's body energy to produce music. We have them now, but nothing is beautiful. The songs it played were probably lost long ago. How much culture have we forgotten? Art, music, stories, it's all gone. You're already rebuilding. Look at Aya. We have a long way to go. In any case, relics like this help us. I'll come back when I have something. Stars guide your travels. Ryder, they've got amazing Remtech research going on here. I love seeing our Milky Way peeps mingling with the Angara. It's early in our interspecies relationship, but I hope we can build on the momentum. We have an amazing opportunity and a great responsibility. Whoa, that's your inspiring voice. You really can't turn off diplomat mode once it's on, can you? <laughs> Just riding you, Ryder. Keep up the good work.
I said, come to me. Uh, uh, so I'm alright. You almost died. died. But what do you do to him here? I I am so much like a semi meeting. I don't want to see any enemies. Is is this, this true? true? Uh, uh, so so right I would rescue me from the care head. She lives with her life. life. Slow me to the enemies, Kadalara. Look how God went. I want to be allies. Equal allies. <laughs> you don't even treat your own equally. Isn't that why the Kroko left? How did he hear you? I've been watching you. you. Your infrared is just like the cat cat, except, except less cautious. What does that mean? You'll know soon enough. Do not trust them so far. Uh, so... He didn't used to be like this. He was curious. Brilliant. But the cat... Even without exaltation, they change us. There's still time to bring him around. I want to believe that, but... His hatred towards aliens... I'll prove we can be trusted. I hope so. Ryder, we just received an emergency recording from EOS. Come to the meeting room when you get back to the Tempest. I can't work under these conditions. What does it take to be left alone? Ambassador Riala sent me to check on you. You reported that someone in the Resistance threatened you. Tell me exactly what happened. I didn't know Riala was sending the Pathfinder. I deserve no less, of course. I was measuring the photonic dispersal from the canopies when some random brute interrupted me. I asked him to move, and he got nasty. Said it was my fault his friend was dead. <laughs> Ridiculous. Do you know what he meant by that? He ranted nonsense about a vessel and selling slots to outsiders. He got right up in my face and compared me to a cat. He wanted to kill me. I could see it in his eyes. The whole conversation made no sense. I think he was inebriated. I'm not saying you're wrong, but dial it down. We're guests here. Exactly. We shouldn't have to put up with this. When he left, I tagged him with infrared dye from my sample kit. Invisible to the naked eye, but not to a scanner. I'll scan people around the Resistance headquarters, see if I find him. You're supposed to represent our interests, Anaya. Go, represent. I have work to do. Sheesh, he's a handful.
Sam, what's this? The decontamination console for visitors to the med center. Touch the start pad to use it. Sam, is this thing safe? Yes. The slight ringing in your ears is nothing to worry about. Very reassuring. I detect the infrared dye Sorvis Len used to mark the person who threatened him. That's our man. Pathfinder, Ephra cleared you to purchase weapons. On my objection. Hey, selling an alien weapons would make me nervous too. I don't do this for Ephra. I respect the most shot. I know why you're here. The bosses. Apology for what led to him. I only have one side of the story. Tell me yours. It's hard to explain. Try me? Aya isn't big enough to give everyone a home. We each live here a short time and then move on. For someone to come, another must go. The exchanges are chosen at random. We call this arrangement the Vassal. Time of change. It worked well. Until now. You lost someone you cared about. Was it because of the Vassal? That's one way to see it. When our lead agreed to make a place for your people here, it came with a cost. My friend won a place of you could see here in How? Comforts for family, resources to improve their home on Havar. He always put others before himself. That's how he died, fighting Ket Vold. When I found out I was angry, Said things to your botanist I shouldn't have, but I'd never hurt your people. I believe you, and I'm sorry for your loss. Between us, that botanist is kind of a jerk. He did hear my anger. I wrecked that. I'll talk to our ambassador, see if we can minimize our impact on your vassal. We don't expect things to. Only that you understand, nothing is free for us. Pathfinder. Any news on what happened to Sorvis Len? Do you know about the Vassal? The Angar lottery that decides who gets. I've heard of it. Why? Angar 
telling their sons to come here so our people can stay in their place. Including members of the me of this arrangement. Well, we have to do something. We could let Angara, who give up their slots, live on the Nexus. It's safer than Vold. Exactly what I was thinking. No one should suffer on our behalf. Thank you, Pathfinder. I'll forward your proposal to Director Ten immediately. That's all for now. I'm here if you need anything. Pilot Marixis. I run supplies to your outposts. What brings you to Aya? Survival supplies the Aya has. I'm waiting on clearance to enter the city, but it's taking too long. I understand their caution, but the outposts need these supplies. I have to get them, now. They let me into the city. I can help. I appreciate that. To start, Eos needs a way to produce food to support population growth. They requested Kiloa seeds to begin their own. Power is lagging without proper solar input. A solar amplifier would give them a boost. The solar technicians here may have the required parts. I'll see what I can find. Ambassador Rialis said you're thinking of moving to the Nexus. I find her. I'm honored even to be considered for the transfer. But I won't be happy as just an observer. I want, need, to work. I engineer power systems. Will I be allowed employment alongside your people? That's the whole point of this exchange. The Nexus needs people like you. That's all I needed to hear. I'll have your ambassador start the transfer. Thank you.
You work on the solar panels. Do you have an amplifier for solar energy? Nothing as big as these, but I have a smaller one on hand. Do you need it? Question, you don't have any Kiloa seeds, do you? I... yes, I do. Need some? I found Kiloa seeds for Eos. Is this enough? It's perfect. I'll make sure Eos gets them. Here, I found the solar amplifier for Vold. They'll be happy to see this. No more power outages. Thank you, Pathfinder. Oh, Gil wanted you to check in.
approach. Voldorp is steady. 